Hello, Rockwell artists and families. Today in class, we read, If You Give a Cat a Cupcake. We then looked at the artwork by Wayne Tybo and looked at some of his delicious desserts. And then we were inspired to create our own cupcake. It's International Dessert Day, so why not? Have fun and good luck. All right, we're going to draw a cupcake today that you get to decorate with, with whatever toppings you would like. I'm gonna make mine a fall theme because right now it's fall. Okay, the first thing you're going to do in order to begin is pick which direction you would like your paper to go. Mine is gonna be portrait, which means it's vertical, it's tall. You may also create one that's gonna be landscape and maybe you can make a couple of cupcakes. I'm gonna make one big giant one. All right, follow along please. The first thing you're going to do is to draw two lines. Those lines are going to represent the side of the cupcake holder, right here, okay? But look, notice they don't go straight up and down. They're gonna turn in a little bit. So I'm gonna make a line right here, almost like a pretend V, but the V never actually touches. The next step is to create the bottom base. And most kids wanna go straight across, but we actually want to curve the bottom. So connect your two lines with a curved line, like so. And then repeat the same thing for the top of your cupcake, right here, because it's a curved object. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is create some lines that are somewhat vertical, but just like our first two lines, they kind of angle downwards, like so. And in between these lines, we're now going to draw a zigzag line. Or you can pretend like you're adding triangles. Okay, now we're going to add the cupcake right here just like so. We're going to make three layers of icing. This is called an organic shape, kind of like a blob. So draw a blob, a long hot dog. <laughs> draw a second one about this big. And then the third one's going to have a little bit of a tail at the end, a little bit of a point. Of course, this might look different in yours and that's totally okay. Like I said before, I'm gonna make mine a fall theme. So I'm gonna decorate with maybe some cinnamon sticks, a pumpkin on top. Maybe you would like to make a unicorn um, cupcake theme. Oh, it looks kinda of like a cherry. <laughs> if I add the lines, it'll look a little bit more like a pumpkin. I'm gonna put some cinnamon sticks up here. Going to add some sprinkles. Maybe some little pumpkin sprinkles or apples, because I do go pick apples sometimes. Maybe you have a holiday or a birthday you like to celebrate. Again, if you want to do an animal or stuff, like a stuffed animal theme, you could do that. Now, once you're done and you've drawn it with pencil, I recommend outlining with a black crayon or black marker before adding color. 